perfect man. Got the whole world in your hands, but you're still reaching out for me. hi guys good morning I honestly don't know if this is going to be a continuation of my vlog or if i'm going to use this video to start a new vlog but regardless welcome to the start of a new vlog my name is tommy Wa and i am a content creator based in nova scotia canada and i literally just post what living in nova scotia looks like so if you're new here do make sure to subscribe join the family like comment share as you guys can see from how i'm dressed I don't know what's happening with the Canadian weather. Everybody said we should expect snow towards the end of November, mid sorry, towards the end of November, going to like mid December. But for some weird reasons, it's already snowing in certain places in Canada, and the weather forecast says it might snow here today. But what's crazy to me is how the um the weather throughout this week is going to be between minus four ish to like three degrees so it's going to be really cold and that is why i had to dress <laughs> because even when the weather was hitting 12 degrees 16 i used to freeze so i don't know why it's been like at minus one or at zero three and the rest so I have to dress for the weather so currently i'm waiting for emma she's coming to pick me up i'm going to school today is monday start of a new week and it's just like You have snow on your hair. <laughs> you guys, I don't know. I feel like a village girl right now, but like, I'm so excited. It's the first time I'm experiencing snow, and it feels really good. I want to be in the pictures. Jesse, have you ever appeared on my channel before? No, I haven't. Jessie, she's snowing. I don't like it. You wait till it's like nighttime and you walk outside in the street and the trees have all the snow on it. And the lights oh are like, God. it's so pretty. This is so nice. Are you guys seeing it? See, this is what snow looks like, literally. You guys know how I've been talking about experiencing snow. And... They said like it, it normally doesn't come this early because of whatever. But just see, I'm gonna pick this up. Can I pick it up from the ground? Yeah. Oh my god! See what it looks like. It's literally ice. Like it's just ice. Fuck okay. you, Emma. Let's go. I don't want Emma. <laughs> let me show you guys, Emma. I don't want Emma to freeze. <laughs> oh my god! I think my camera is really wet. Okay. I don't want Emma to freeze because see, she had to come out because of me. I'll and be right. I'll be I've literally I'm freezing. God, I pity my hair. Oh, hey, hey, I should have one hair to go out. I'm so happy. And then I'm so sad I get to experience this alone. Like, I really wish like I had my sister here. This is a thing, you open your mouth and try to get snow in your mouth and I'm already having I don't know how I'm going to survive. I don't know how I'm going to survive this day because what are you trying to do? I'm gonna snow my So she's taking off snow from her car and trying to do this. Oh they stick together. Oh I see now. Oh 
close to this? Yeah, you can just. It's frozen. Wow. Hi guys. We are in a Jamaican restaurant. Tell me why I always tell you guys that Emma is African. <laughs> But she'll be lying. She doesn't want to confess and tell me the truth because she was literally the one that set it up and brought us here. And I'm trying out Jamaican food for the first time. I don't know if I have any Jamaican subscriber or anybody that subscribes my channel is Jamaican, but I've heard so much about Jamaican food and I'm so happy to be here to experience it. <laughs> and let me give you guys like a tour of what's basically like. This is Emma. I dress like our professor today. Yeah, she That's dressed. I have a plaid shirt on for <laughs> Halloween. <laughs> yeah, today's Halloween, by the way. Today, today's Halloween. And Emma dressed like our professor. Sean. So this, <laughs> what is the restaurant? Like, it's so Jamaican. It's giving Jamaican vibe. I can imagine like Nigerian having, because I think this is the color, like, this is Jamaican. The flag. The flag color. So imagine like, in Nigeria, like having a restaurant and everywhere being green, white, green. I don't know. I don't know. It will just look very funny to be in, but I think their color is really nice. The whole red, yellow, green. Just give me some pop. Do you want to know? Jamaican rice with the sauce and I don't know what I don't I don't know what I ordered. Chickpeas, chickpea curry. Is that what it is? And this is vegan what? Vegan A nice vegan cold jerk tofu wrap. Oh yeah, tofu wrap. Ja um, Jamaican style wrap. Period. How far there is so much love to give. Something's telling me this time. Baby, baby, now I know. Day. Guys, I literally just getting home and I checked my mailbox and my AdSense pin is here. Oh my goodness. Just check it out. I have been waiting for this pin since like forever. That's the only way I can have access to my YouTube money. And like the money I've just been piling up and stacking up there and I'm like, I want to need my money. And it's here. But... Emma is waiting for me downstairs, so I can't open it now. So when I get back, I have to go to work now. I have an evening shift. And since Emma dropped me off, I don't want to use a cab back home. What am I saying? I don't want to use a cab to my workplace. And I also don't want to work because it's really cold. You guys know it did snow yesterday. So uh, she's waiting for me. Another thing I got, let me just show you guys real quick, is... Uh, so I got a blender... My house is in a total mess right now, but I got a blender. Finally, I'll come and give you guys the gist about this blender when I get back. I know by now, eh? You guys be thinking, ah, Miss Tommy probably has money because every single time I, I'm vlogging or I'm somewhere, I'm either in a shopping mall or I'm somewhere buying something. But this, this is the person you guys should blame. <laughs> 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 because I don't spend money like right now. I knew we we're coming here. I had to drop my card at home. So I dropped all my cards at home. I've seen so many things I like, but I don't have money to buy it. That's what you should do, guys. When you see that you're spending money beyond usual and Just you know make that you're a going list for broke. later and then come back when I don't know. You're still blaming on me. Oh my god, you this guys, is... I'm having baby fever. Just see yeah. how this is so cute. <laughs> Just this is so cute. And now, Tommy wants future baby. <laughs> now I actually want to have 
like I'm having this <laughs> why will you do that <laughs> no I want to have a child <laughs> like I want to give birth I don't know I want to give birth and the man doesn't want to come and marry me now and it's until I get I give birth outside marriage people oh, know I'm joking mommy I'm joking no Mommy, I'm joking. No, don't call me and say what did I go and say. Oh my God, this is so cute. <laughs> but why is this so expensive? It's five dollars for a baby. Probably handmade. Yeah, it's obviously handmade. Uh, it's obviously handmade. Obviously. Ah, uh, but this is so cute. Just look at this one. Oh, you see. You guys, we just got to one store, and the name of the store is called Frenchies. So they sell like used clothes, that's secondhand clothes here. And literally, I entered, you know that okrika smell that we have in Nigeria, like when you buy like used clothes, the okrika smell, that okay smell. That is, um, this is literally probably where they get some of these clothes from, they ship it down to Nigeria because they do actually. Do you see? She just, Emma just told me they do. Because once you enter into the let me show you guys. Like it's literally like just see they have like clothes going all the way down and it's smelling okurika. You won't understand. I don't know what you're saying. I know. <laughs> <laughs> She's so lost. She's like, I don't know what you're saying. All I all I heard was it smells like creator. Okurika. Okurika? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Yeah, it smells like okurika and it's like it's crazy. I'm just gonna check. Come let's check this place. Hi guys, I am literally just getting home. I'm so tired, and today is Halloween. And as I was getting home, this is around past 8 p.m. ish. I'm just getting back from work. And I could see kids in front of people's houses, trick-or-treating, like collecting chocolate and candies and all that and just amazing because I always see this on TV and obviously we don't celebrate Halloween in Nigeria and all that stuff and I'm just exhausted I got in front of my building and I'm seeing all of them all dressed like when I was in the cab right as I turned to come down I saw like this kid just beside like the car and I um like I was startled. I was like <laughs> because he's all like all dressed. He has like the drawings and blood, whatever, whatever by his face. I'm like, ah, these people they don't have problems in their life. To be honest, that's why they they have the time to be celebrating all these things. They don't have problems. I'm just so tired. Um so before I left for work, okay, first of all, you guys will be seeing me on different type of hairs. I don't wear my bone straight to work. I only wear that to school. I wear this one to work because <laughs> they think this is my hair. For some reasons, when I took down my locks, when I came to work the next day with this hair, oh, they were like, oh my God, you dyed your hair. Oh my God, you dyed your hair, I love it. And I'm like, mm. I only told my manager that it was a wig. So now, even when I go to school and I have to go like for my shift, I, and I have to go to work. I come home, change my wig to this wig, and then go to work with this wig because I, I don't have the strength to start explaining anything to anybody. But, um, before I left this afternoon, my AdSense pin came. Oh my goodness, like, I have been waiting for this thing. They sent it on the 10th of October. They sent it to take around two, three weeks, and I've been waiting since then. And it was in my mail today. So I'm going to impute this out and cash out my money. This is from Gogo, as you can see. Uh, your girl is officially making money from YouTube. And I just want to use this avenue to say a very big thank you to everybody that watches my channel everybody that watches my video or that shares my video i actually made much more than i expected that i will make in the space of one month that i got monetized obviously i think the last day the last day right of um september i think it was around 28 29 ish 
and Madison Spin is here. Today is the 31st of October, so it's exactly a month plus or minus. And I didn't put up a video last week, so thank you guys so much. Like, it's not a lot of money, but it's way more than I expected, and I'm grateful to every one of you. I also bought a blender, let me show you guys. I want to also use this avenue to say a very big thank you to the people that reached out to me. So I got DMs from a couple of people that wanted to buy my blender because I complained here on my channel that I didn't have a blender. But for some reasons, I just, I don't know whether it's because of my upbringing or something, I find it very hard to just accept gifts, especially like monetary stuff from people. So thank you so much for caring and reaching out and wanting to buy my blender. I appreciate it. I've already bought it though. So that nobody needs to like bother around me again. I was able to get this at a very affordable price. Somebody recommended me buying it from Canadian Tire. So I went to Canadian Tire and as God we have it, the blender was on sale, so it was crazy cheap. Crazy cheap. Like cheap compared to like how much other blenders are being sold. So yeah, I got this one and my apartment is a mess. I've been so busy this week. Last week was worse. But this week is not as bad as last week because last week I had tests like back to back literally. But this week I only have two tests and that will be on Thursday. I should be fine. I should be fine. And then I just go back home like I said and I'm very tired. I will have dinner, speak to my parents and film the video that's supposed to go up on Friday. So there will be no vlog. Okay, by the time you guys are watching this, <laughs> this vlog will be out. <laughs> but I'm still editing like vlog, the vlog, and I'm not going to put it up like. But then you guys are watching that last week, right? So I'm going to put up the answer. And... There's no need for this explanation. If you're watching this video, should I just know that the answer, the question and answer video is up on my channel. It was a previous video, so please check it out. I'm going to put up the link so that you can also click and watch it. Please don't ask me any question. I'm very sure I must have answered or I will answer all the questions in that video so please click on that link and it will also be in my description box so watch it and I'm sure there will be an answer to whatever question that you have for me and yeah I'm so tired of talking bye guys then go cash out my money from YouTube per I'm not making a lot of money oh my god anyway guys guys so i told you guys yesterday that my google items came <laughs> the sun is up it's a beautiful day my beginning will be as bright as the sun come won't you come along and it feels so bright it's like luck is raining on me Go and follow your heart Doesn't matter how far There is so much love to give Something's telling me this time Baby, baby, now I know Baby, baby, gotta go There is so much love to give Hi guys I should show you guys my face right now But I look like shit but I just finished cooking, so this is semo vita and ogbono soup. If you guys know the chaotic process it took to make this ogbono soup and make it a success, you will laugh because I literally had to check YouTube. Like I know how to make ogbono, right? But for some reason, I don't even know why I was mixing things up in my head. And I wanted to be sure like I was doing the right thing. So I called my mom, confirmed a few things, checked YouTube and everything came out nice. So I'm just about to eat while I watch YouTube. I don't know how this came up because this is definitely not me. <laughs> but like after that, I plan to write down my to-do, like every assignment I have due. I normally like put like everything I have due here. So I just plan to do that. Uh Hi guys, what's happening? <clears throat> Today is Sunday and it's my day off. No school, no work. It feels amazing, to be honest. Like not to have school or work, but like I have a couple of things that I do this week. 
which i couldn't do throughout the week so i'm trying to do it today and tomorrow tomorrow is public holiday here in canada apparently there's something called remembrance day that they normally celebrate it was yesterday but you know how when public holidays or like holidays fall on a weekend in nigeria then they kind of extend it to like next month like closer monday that kind of thing yeah that's what's happening um i just realized that since i started my canada series relocation whatever i have never spoken about my business <laughs> and in as much as like i'm no longer in nigeria i have a business that is currently running which is not stopping even if i'm not there i have people currently handling it in my absence so i decided to like come and talk to you guys about it so if you don't know already which you should know but if you don't know already i run a business or should i say i run two businesses but i have like one major business where i sell shoulder bags i've been on this business since like 2020 it's been amazing i've been having i have experienced setbacks up downs wherever but currently i'm experiencing a setback in that business because ever since i left there has been like less activity slow sales stuff like that so i only brought one bag <laughs> because of extra luggage i only brought one bag so like i said i basically sell shoulder bags and this is one of the shoulder bags it's a um small mini bag that you could like carry on your dates to church if you're not the kind of person that carries ludu it's amazing like currently this bag i take to work because all i have to do is just throw in my lip gloss my wallet my phone pen the major like essentials i'll need so i'm going to link my business in my description box it's always my description box and i'm also going to put like the name on the screen please you guys should check it out you guys should buy something i need to sell out before the end of this year so that i can like stock up proper proper for next year and i also plan to like add like new designs a new set of bags but i can't do that if i don't sell out these bags <laughs> so please 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 check it out i am the owner of the brand and i have like people that are handling it for me the brand is based in abuja i offer um or we offer nationwide delivery i really don't do worldwide yet but i offer nationwide delivery so everywhere in nigeria you can get the bag <laughs> and yeah so thank you guys so much in advance for that Please come to my aid though. Is this normal? I'm trying to pour the akara inside. The thing is spreading. Like this, this is not how my mom used to do it though. Huh? When I say I miss my mommy now. See. Why is this spreading? Why is this spreading? Do my mom is thing would climb on each other? I'm already beginning to be tired of this living alone because this living alone is not living alone. It's not living. I don't understand why this Akara is spreading. I used to see Akara women do this thing. It will be big like this. They used to put yeast inside Akara. No, I don't know what are you saying. But like, I don't even know if I'm doing this right. Oh my goodness. The Akara is not even fine. You will just see, it's not even fine. Ha ha ha! <laughs> Chesty! It's for me. You people, it's for me, no. The Akara is for me. <laughs> okay? Time to flap this one. 
Flap, flap. <laughs> Let's go there. Hey, hey. Look, I feel like this heat is too much. Let me reduce it a little bit. In fact, I will burn inside the London. I've heard of things like that. Mm. Guys, so the funniest thing just happened. I, like I said, I don't have. I don't have um, bread and I just finished frying akara. I'll show you guys the akara when I get back home. It's actually tasted really nice. But this store, I'm trying to walk down to the closest store to my place. And I want to get um, bread because there is no way, there is no way I'm going to enjoy that akara without bread. Like I said, my pops because I didn't put it in the fridge when I came to Canada so I have a fun guy in it so I don't have um, custard I should actually get custard next time I go to like Walmart but right now I'm trying to go get bread and they are closing by 5 and this is 4 30 I hope I get there in time <laughs> oh my god I always do everything last minute I need to do better anyway Let's hope I get there on time. You guys, they were open. Oh my goodness. They were open. Oh, let me thank Jesus Christ. They were open. <sighs> so, they were doing a promo for two breads for five dollars. So, one is $2.99. And if you buy two, you get it for five dollars, which makes sense. But, like, I'm not really a bread person. The last time I bought two breads at home, it took me almost a month to finish it. I had to be refrigerating the bread, and the bread was already tasting stale somehow, somehow. Thank you. And the bread was already tasting stale somehow, somehow. So, like, I didn't like it. I'd already carried two breads over. I just dropped one back because even though I'm, like, that saves money. I may not necessarily it didn't take me a lot of time to eat the bread <laughs> so I just dropped it back I took only one and I took meat yeah so bread secured let's go enjoy our akara I just go home see even the bread is getting frozen like my hands are literally frozen right now but like a couple of people reached out to me and said I shouldn't be dipping my hands in warm water whenever it's frozen so I'm not going to do that, but it's very painful. It was really cold outside. Um, this is the akara I did. I'm going to keep the mini paste in the freezer for next time I'm going to make akara. So I just want to eat right now. I'm so hungry. All I had out through today was quicker oats. So yeah. <laughs> this is so weird. I'm using my flashlight right now to film. I just got off work. And for some weird reasons, I'm in a good mood. Hmm. I've been in a very terrible mood all weekend. Like, literally all weekend. Yesterday, I broke down as usual in my room, just crying like a baby. But I feel like better today. Is it weird if I say I like my job? Like, it's not depressing working there, to be honest. Like, I don't feel sad when I'm there. Everybody's really nice. So whenever I have to like leave, I, I'm not mad about it. I'm cold. I'm cold. I wanted to give you guys like a gist, but let me get home because I'm freezing. I need to put my hands inside my pocket. Okay, bye guys. So I'm currently at Walmart and I'm trying to get um, shoe a shoe rack because I keep my shoes on the floor and I feel like I should be able to get a shoe rack and normally my, the aesthetic for my house is white and grey so in normal sense I'm supposed to get this even though I don't like how it looks but this is how much it costs it costs $16 this one costs $10 and genuinely I'm trying to save money and this is a little bit expensive and I don't understand why like this one is more expensive and this one is cheaper so I'm going to ruin the aesthetics of my house and just get this one as ten dollars from the picture it doesn't look like you can take up to 12 pairs of shoe but it says you can take to up to 12 pairs 
if I buy it or when I buy it, if I get home and it actually cannot take off the 12 pairs of shoes, that's when they're gonna say crazy because I'm gonna return it back. So I already picked it. I completely forgot. I completely forgot that I wasn't filming and I have to come back to show you guys. Now, the next thing that I want to get but I won't be able to get this cutting. So when I did my measurement, I'm trying to do this top to bottom aesthetic. And um, I was thinking of going with this cutting for like my inner, inner cutting shall go for this one. Um, Cause I'm trying to like go for like all white. I asked like people on my Instagram to help me choose. Most people went towards gray, but like my house is already too gray and I want to like, popping color so i'm like i'll do white i was going to get this one so normally i was looking at 93 inches in length but this is 84 inches and that's like the best they have so i probably will have to go with this one and i'm trying to go with like a cotton that has this so that it can be easy to like open it but i'm going for i want a white cotton and this is the best they have that this is the closest they have to white and i don't like this and plus it's 63 inches and i'm looking for 84. the 84 that they have is this one this one can go it's an off-white color but like i like the material and it's really nice but it does not have the rings thingy because it's like regular this thing and i don't want that i can remember when i was in nigeria when i was shopping for my room and i wanted to do my curtains because of the whole ring um thingy it was really expensive like it was crazy expensive so i couldn't get it but this time around difference between the the um curtains with the rings and the ones without the rings is just two dollars i'm like okay i'll get the ones with the rings but they don't have the color white with the rings and the colors they have that are kind of close to white that i would have gotten they have like designs on it and i don't like it and then they have gray like look at gray looking at me right now but it won't be pretty in my room i want something that will make the entire room to just pop so i probably will have to come back later or check on that store so yeah i'm currently waiting for my cab i just got water and my shoe rack and that's it then i'll just like move around and see oh that is i need pillow too but it's not a like priority right now because i like have a pillow but i need more pillows um i'm just looking at things okay i'm seeing another section with curtains and these ones are like really really cheap oh but they are shorter in length that's why they are this cheap they are nine dollars they are short curtains that's why they are this cheap so i cannot get them so yeah this is literally what walmart looks like I've got to see you guys all my face like I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> I'm just going to like look through and see um if there is anything that is cheap that I probably need. One thing I'm currently trying to get like a necessity right now, I'm trying to get a couch for my house, but like I haven't been able to see a couch that I can afford yet, so it's just like something i'm working towards i want to get like a very nice two-seater couch oh god i can't wait for what my house is gonna look like when i'm done right now i just have like the basics in my house i have nothing extra aside the basics but now i'm trying to now start to actually make it look like a home i'm trying to convert it from a house to a home so yeah bye i've not decided we just need to unbox this room break that. I hope I didn't break that. Oh, this, is, this is what I have to break my fridge. So, let's see how this works basically. Oh. My only problem with it, wait, I think I broke something. Oh my god. You guys, I think I broke I'm not even showing the receipt away because you 
this is the kind of containing up to four. Ah, this is the thing I hate about Canada. <laughs> this is the thing I hate about this country. Beauty stuff. Coughing up the mess Drop it in the water Let the daughter find an image with the rest She'll be learning how to breathe Spinning through identity Reveal another pretty little scheme Save her mind Hold her hand And don't believe a lie You understand me Walk her down the valley Pack a piece of heaven for the bottoms of her feet Teach her how to jump and how to stretch when she reach Like the angels do And you gon' make it through now Tell about the healer Greater is the one within a column as the leader One eternity later Perfect Yeah So all good all set so i don't even know where i'm going to put this because this cannot be here because i plan to get a couch and i feel like my couch is going to be here and my couch might also kind of be here and then i plan to move this somewhere else i don't know i just need to get the couch first and i'll probably move this one to like behind the door over there or something i don't know i'll figure it out Hold a hand and don't believe a lie you understand me walk her down the valley pack a piece of heaven for the bottoms of her feet teach her how to jump and how to stretch when she i just want to put it out there as a woman once you get to a point in your life where you feel like your life is turning upside down and nothing is making sense and you're sad and you just feel like what am i doing it's your period i had the most terrible weekend woke up this morning because i had to do an assignment i was not in the mood i didn't pick anybody's calls i just got my period and i already hit today so yeah Happy New Week. <laughs>